Hello, today I am going to be showing you seven tips and tricks for your LG V60 Thin Q. These will all be split into seven separate videos. Now, for my second tip, I'm going to show you how to change the navigation bar behavior. When you purchase your LG V60 Thin Q, you'll notice there's a tiny white line at the bottom which requires you to use gestures to switch between apps or go back a page or something. You don't have to worry about that anymore. What you'll want to do is you'll want to go into settings and then you'll want to go into display and then on the top of the screen the third option below is navigation bar so I'll want to click on that and it's currently set on gestures. We will want to change that to buttons only and it will switch it back to how it has been done in the previous LG phones with the back button, the home button, and the all apps open button. Now, here's something else cool. If you click on button combination, you can add more buttons to the bottom, like this notification. You drag and drop and then put it in the, uh, in the phone screen as seen below, or as seen at the top. And then right below, it will appear. So for this, I have the menu drop down as an option. So if I click on that, it automatically brings down the menu as opposed to sliding your finger from the top and doing it. And then once you have it down, you can press that button again to bring it back up. And then you have the screenshot option, which you can drag and drop into it as well for a total of five buttons. And it is what it sounds like. You just click on it and it will take a screenshot rather than using the power button and the down arrow key at the same time in order to do so. Thank you for subscribing. Please be sure to like this video and check out some of my other videos too.